Here are our top 5 stories of the week. Number 5. Deep dive on how Juve Automotion brings the first hydrogen trucks to Austria's roads. Tyrolean startup is laying the foundation for the sustainable decarbonization of road transport in Austria. Juve Automotion GmbH, based in Innsbruck, operates in the areas of trading, operation and maintenance of hydrogen-powered fuel cell commercial vehicles. For the Tyrolean food retailer MPREIS, Juve will put the first fuel cell trucks into operation in summer 2022, the first of their kind in Austria. By 2024, Heizen Motors will deliver a total of 70 zero-emission vehicles to Juve Automotion, which is responsible for exclusive sales in Austria. Number 4. World's first hydrogen trains enter regular passenger service July 26, 2022. The world's first hydrogen-powered trains in regular passenger service are now in operation, having begun service July 25th on a German regional rail line between Bremervard and Buxtehude. The initial service is being billed as preliminary, in case operating adjustments are needed before a reliable service can be officially launched, so older diesel multiple unit train sets remain as a backup for the next few months. The trains cost $86 million including a 30-year maintenance contract, part of which has been funded by the German federal government. They are based at the EDB shop in Bremervord, where a hydrogen fueling station has been provided. Number 3. Development Milestone, Daimler Truck Tests Fuel Cell Truck with Liquid Hydrogen. Daimler Truck reaches its next milestone on the road to sustainable transportation also with hydrogen-based drives. Since last year, a Mercedes-Benz Gen H2 truck fuel cell prototype has been undergoing intensive testing, both on the in-house test track and on public roads. Daimler Truck is now putting another prototype into operation to test the use of liquid hydrogen. Newly installed prototype filling station at the Development and Testing Center in Worth enables the refueling with liquid hydrogen. Number 2. Iberdrola and BP to collaborate to accelerate EV charging infrastructure and green hydrogen production. Iberdrola and BP announced their intention to form a strategic collaboration aiming to help accelerate the energy transition. Together, the companies intend to collaborate to significantly expand fast EV public charging infrastructure to support the adoption of electric vehicles, as well as to develop large-scale green hydrogen production hubs in Spain, Portugal, and the UK. The plan includes installing and operating an initial 5,000 fast charge points by 2025, and up to a total of 11,000 by 2030, including BP and Iberdrola's existing and future fast charging hubs. Number 1. Goodbye E-Cars, BMW wants to mass-produce hydrogen cars. Hydrogen as an energy carrier will play an important role in many regions of the world. To this end, the BMW Group is launching the everyday testing of near-series vehicles with a hydrogen fuel cell drive on European roads, according to a statement from the company. BMW has been working on fuel cell technology together with the Japanese car manufacturer Toyota since 2013. The buy electric car, BMW wants to produce hydrogen cars in series. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video please hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. We invite you to like, comment, and share with others who may enjoy our content.